Hey guys, you're Apply here, um, and um, this is um, we're going to be playing through um, some of Fight Night Champion, the new Fight Night game. Uh, this is an absolutely brilliant game, and um, here I am to play it through, show you the uh, basics of the gameplay, and show you um, some of the things you can do. Um, so I'm going to start off, I'm just going to do um, a simple Fight Now mode, which is a bit like a... I don't know, FIFA kind of thing, it'd be like a kickoff, just basic like exhibition kind of thing. Um, and obviously, it's got the standard kind of thing that EA use, which you choose your teams. Um, so, this works for like two player. I don't know how many players you can actually play. I'll have a look um, later. Uh, but yeah, uh, you can add kind of players in. I imagine it's going to be obviously, uh, I doubt you'll be able to have more than two players. I mean, a bit logical. Um, so you get classes, as you'd expect. There's like, um, band, bam, phantom weight, I don't know. Something that's not very weighty. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, there's only one kid in this class, but there you go. There's obviously the featherweights, you can see. Uh, lightweights. Um, now this game isn't just like about the new kind of uh, boxes. It's also some like legends in there. Uh, there are some boxes that actually aren't in there. The ring key hands are cool. There are a lot of uh, boxes missing because um, I, I mean I haven't actually found Amir Khan. I don't think he's on there. Uh, I think it's all um, licensing kind of thing. Uh, so let's just go ahead. I'm just going to go into uh, heavyweight one because obviously, well, in my opinion, I prefer the heavyweight kind of things because that's uh, kind of better. Um, I'm going to be Mike Tyson because he's a monster. Um, and I'll pick someone easy to go against me just for. Uh, kind of show. I don't know who this kid is, this Mexican guy by the looks of it, so um, let's go against him. And you can obviously choose the arenas which you play in, which is really cool. Um, New York Arena, let's just try that one. So I load up, you see some of the controls there. You can do things like headbutts and low blows, which um, you're allowed to do once before you get. Uh, you get a warning, or uh, I, don't, I don't know how really how it works, but if you get like if you hit them once or do um, something you're not supposed to, I think you get like one chance to do that. So it's always worth doing. Anyway, the whole like system of how it works. Once you got the stamina, a lot of people have actually been moaning on forums and things saying that the whole um, stamina system isn't very realistic. Um, a lot of people are a bit annoyed about that, but in general, the game is um, pretty popular. So it's to be quite good. So um, you like kind of um, you basically um, block the punches with RT, and then you can dodge as well using LT and moving around. Um, hitting is you can use your B and X to. Uh, I think B is the right uh, punch, which I just did there. Um, and oh, that hurt. Uh, X is a left punch. Um, but you can always use your analog stick for things like uppercuts and um, combos as well. I mean, combos is a big part of things. I don't really use combos, I just kind of like rapidly press it, depending on what my attentions are. Now, I've also played um, on the champion mode, and I think that's a really big feature of um, this game. Oh, that must have hurt. Uh, I'll just show you low blow there. I don't know if that actually connected, I think it is. So the champion mode, as I was saying, um, I played it straight away, and I think this champion mode was the main thing that got me hooked to the game initially, because it's, it's, it's just like a kind of Rocky style film, where the protagonist kind of always gets back from kind of um, the unlucky things. Um, but it is actually genuinely really fun, and the story is a kind of real good, feel good kind of thing, where you play as um, this guy as a middleweight, and then um, you get set up, uh, and I'm not going to give you any spoilers or anything, but um, basically un you're a bit unlucky, and you come back um, into the ring. Not really giving too much away there. Uh, you get the kind of... Um, thing like that, ooh, big start, uh, where you can kind of re-heal at the um, corners as you can imagine at the end of the round. A lot of it, you kind of, um, I think, when, when you dodge a punch, 
like that, it flashes, it's kind of like a, a kind of uh, big hit as a kind of come, uh, oh look at that, that's what I thought. I don't know what rating this game is, you know, it's pretty gruesome, there's a lot of blood, the graphics are fantastic, I mean if you want to watch this video, watch in 720p, um, if your computer or internet will let you, because seriously, you will see some amazing, I mean, especially when you knock someone out, the graphics in it are astonishing, when, when you, I mean, the sweat and stuff, I think the team of art in this game have really worked towards that. Um, I don't think in a boxing game there's too much, obviously there is a lot to work on, but it's a lot less than like an RPG or something, I mean, they will have a big development team, they can focus on the art, um, and I just want to kind of talk about one thing I've noticed in this game, if you actually look into the uh, crowd, I mean it's quite hard to do because you're concentrating, look at that, he's stunned, and pouch in face. Uh, but if you look into the crowd, it, it genuinely pretty realistic, you know, I thought that was good. Anyway, there's this feature here where you can kind of slow motion and watch that uppercut. And that looks pretty sweet, get the 720p on that, because that is absolutely sweet. PVR really shines. Yeah. Uh, anyway guys, uh, I might as well end the video here, you've got a brief um, summary of how the game works. Uh, as I carry on to absolutely own this kid. Um, I'll uh, end the video right there. So um, thanks for watching. See you next time. It's Jordan by here, and I'll see you later.